Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So we're finally back after the lengthy international break. We're finally back to league football. So today we're going to be previewing this weekend's match day five matches. Stay tuned. Hey, 300 beats going crazy. Okay, guys, so let's get right into it. Kicking off on Saturday, we have the Merseyside Derby, which is Everton taking on Liverpool. Now, this is going to take place at the Goodison Park at 12.30 p.m. Now, this is one match that nobody wants to miss. It's going to be an entertaining match. Everton, as we know, are top of the Premier League table currently after winning four of the last four Premier League games. Now, Liverpool, who were trashed by Aston Villa last time out, 7-2, which is quite a defeat for last season's champions are going to be looking to redeem themselves in this game. So this game is going to be a really tight one. It's going to be a tactical masterclass. And we're going to see how it turns out. So I'm going to predict a score of 1-1 in this game. I'm thinking that's going to be a draw. Okay, now moving to the next game. We have Chelsea taking us Southampton at the Stamford Bridge at 3 p.m. Now this match, I think, is going to be interesting also. Chelsea will be looking to continue from where they left off after trashing Crystal Palace 4-0 last time out. Southampton also beating West Brom. 2-0 during the last match day. So, I think this game is going to be pretty pretty straightforward. So, I'm going to predict a score of 3-1 in favor of Chelsea. Okay, so moving on, guys. We have Manchester City taking on Arsenal at the Etihad Stadium at 5.30 p.m. Now, this match is also going to be a very, very interesting match. Now, Manchester City, who were held by Marcelo Bielsa's Leeds United to a 1-1 draw during the last time out, will be looking to redeem themselves. And Arsenal, who also defeated Sheffield United 2-1 during the last time out, will be looking to continue that form. Now, this is going to be another tactical masterclass between Arteta and Pep Guardiola. So, this match, I'm going to predict a score of 2-1 in favour of Arsenal. I just feel that Arteta is going to edge out Pep Guardiola the second time. Now, moving to the last match of the day, we have Newcastle United taking on Manchester United at the St. James Park at 8 p.m. Now, this match I'm really looking forward to. Really, really looking forward to. Because Manchester United will be looking to redeem themselves after losing 6 1 to Tottenham Hotspur last time out. After Anthony Marshall read in the earlier stages of the game. So, I'm really looking forward to see how Manchester United are going to remedy that defeat. And Newcastle United also, who also defeated. Burnley 3 1 last time out. We'll be looking to continue that winning streak. So I'm predicting the score of 2 1 in favor of Newcastle United. I just think that they're going to edge out Manchester United once more due to Manchester United's lack of defensive efficiency. Now moving to Sunday, the first match on Sunday, we have Sheffield United taking on Fulham at the Bramall Lane at 12 noon. Now, this match also is going to be very interesting. It's gonna be, I think it's going to be pretty straightforward because Fulham haven't really had a great record in the Premier League since returning. And Sheffield United also have had a bad start to the season, to the Premier League season. They haven't won any matches and score, have scored only just one goal in all their last four matches. So I'm predicting a score of 1-0 in that match in favour of Sheffield United. Okay, now to the next match. We have Crystal Palace taking on Brighton at the Selhurst Park at 2 p.m. Now this match also, I think, is going to be pretty straightforward. Crystal Palace after losing 4-0 to Chelsea last time out. And Brighton also losing 4-2 to Everton at the last time out. So I'm predicting a score of 2-1 in favour of Crystal Palace. Now to the next match. We have Tottenham Hotspur taking on West Ham United at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium at 4.30pm. Now this match is going to be a classic. I think it's going to be really interesting to see what's going to happen in this match. Because both teams have been on fire recently. Tottenham Hotspur defeating Manchester United 6-1 in the last time out. And West Ham United also defeating Leicester City away 3-0 last time out. So I think this game is going to be really interesting to see what happens in it. And I think it's going to be really, really tight. So I'm predicting 1-1 in that match. I think it's going to be a draw. I think both teams are not going to get to so many chances in that game. So the last game of the day, we have Leicester City taking on Aston Villa at the Kicks Power Stadium at 7.15pm. Now this game I think will be really interesting to see what happens in it. Because Leicester City are going into this game on the back of a 3 day defeat at home to West Ham United last time out. While Aston Villa, on the other hand, will be going into this game with a lot of confidence after defeating last season's champions, Liverpool, 7-2 at the Villa Park last time out. 
So, this game, I think, will be really interesting to see what happens. But I'm thinking Leicester City are going to edge it out. So, I'm predicting out a score of 2 1 in favor of Leicester City. Okay, moving on to Monday. We have West Bromwich Albion taking on Burnley at the Hot Runs at 5.30 p.m. Now, this game also will be interesting to see what happens in it. Because West Brom have had a poor start to their life in the Premier League. Losing three of their last four games and drawing just one. And Burnley also with zero wins in their last three games. Losing all three of their last three Premier League games. So it's going to be really interesting to see what they're going to play out in this game. So I'm predicting a score of 2-0 uh, in favour of West Bromwich Albion. Now to the last game of the match day, we have Wolverhampton Team Wanderers taking on Leeds United at the Molyneux Stadium at 8pm. So this match, I think it's going to be really interesting to see what happens in it. Wolverhampton Team Wanderers defeating Fulham in the last time out. And Leeds United also holding Manchester City to a 1-1 well draw. So this game, I think, is going to be a really good game. It's going to be a show of talent, of speed, of agility, of skills. So I'm predicting a score of 3-1 um, in favour of... Of Wolverhampton Wanderer. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, and also click the notification bell to get notified anytime I drop a new video. Thank you guys. Hola.